What's going on guys? Welcome back to another news video. What I got for you guys today is some big news. We are going to be talking about the biggest update that we are going to be receiving here in season one, and that is called the mid-season update, pretty much season one reloaded. So with this update, there's going to be brand new content, pretty much fully refreshing the game. I know a lot of things, uh, maybe you guys have finished all of your challenges, battle passes have probably been completed by now, things like that. A lot of people I've been noticing have been getting close to max level already and uh, just finishing everything they need to do. So this update couldn't come soon. Sooner, but the good news is it is set to release in exactly a week and a half the update will be dropping on december 14th and that is going to be in the morning around 10 a.m pacific standard time is usually when they do these updates but the official date is going to be on december 14th now even better news so if you don't have modern warfare 2 you've only been playing like warzone and things like that uh the free to play ones you're actually going to be able to have free access starting on december 15th so a trusted source said right here sources with knowledge of activision plans have said that modern warfare 2 will have its first free multiplayer weekend starting on december 15th it was said that modern warfare 2 season 1 mid-season update will start on december 14th which i mentioned with free multiplayer weekend starting on the 15th to early hours Hours GMT time zone of December 19th. So pretty much you got that entire weekend starting from, I believe, Thursday, Friday, and then the whole weekend to play it for free. And then on top of that, this is not confirmed, but a lot of people are assuming that this will happen, especially since the game is also going to be free at the time, is we are finally going to get our first double XP weekend. We did have a double XP event that did happen, but unfortunately, it was only for like 24 hours and half of it was exclusive only to PlayStation. So the first day was only PlayStation. The second day was available to everyone. And by the time people even noticed, they didn't really mention it or anything like that. By the time most people noticed, it was already over with. So are expecting that. But now that we got the dates out of the way, let's go ahead and let's talk about the content we are going to be getting. So the first and most important thing in my opinion is we're going to be receiving a new map and that is 6v6 for shipment. It's going to be set at night. This is exactly how it looks. Here's a photo. Also, obviously, along with a new map, we're going to be getting a mosh pit for it. So we're going to get that shipment 24-7 playlist. So if you like that map, you can go ahead and grind that out. Unfortunately, we don't know if there's going to be any other maps as of right now. This is the only map that they've officially announced. They did say there's going to be many surprises that were going to be in store for this update. So there's a chance there's going to be another map, but as of right now, I'm only going to tell you what's guaranteed, and that is shipment. So the next thing that we have that is also guaranteed is a brand new DLC weapon, and that is the Chimera Assault Rifle, also known as the Honey Badger. Now, in order to be able to unlock this, you have two options. One, you can purchase it with a store bundle, and the second is to do a free challenge which most likely the free challenge is going to be available on the free platforms because it's going to be exactly like the M13B where you have to kill the chemist and then you exfil the blueprint and then you would end up getting the base weapon. So it's going to be somewhat similar to that and then you'll be able to do that challenge. You'll be able to have access to this weapon on all game modes, Warzone, DMZ, and Modern Warfare. So that is a free weapon that you will be able to get. You don't really have to purchase the bundle to get it. The next thing that we have, this one unfortunately is going to be locked behind a paywall and that is going to be the two brand new operators, which is Klaus and Gaz. They're going to be available in a bundle during the mid-season update. Now, I don't know what the bundle exactly is, but it's probably going to be somewhat similar to the Ghost Bundle where it, when you upgraded that, you ended up getting the whole Ghost Pack with all those skins and Captain Price and all of them so maybe it's going to be somewhat similar to that one yeah it's not going to be free unfortunately but going on over to the next thing that we have this is going to be the introduction to raids so raids episode one is going to be dropping as well and what this is is it's going to be continuing from the campaign with special ops mission so if you're a fan of the campaign this is just going to be continuing and you can play this as well with friends so it says continuing the story of modern warfare 2's campaign raids will be the ultimate challenge for trios with a mix of stealth all out action and puzzle solving objectives expect a full tactical overview and additional raids intel at the mid-season update sadly this is the only description that we have i will show you guys some photos that they gave us but that's all that we got so we got to wait until the update until we get exact details exact information on what this raid mission is how it's gonna play out and things like that so as of right now these are the big updates that we are expecting to receive now i'm gonna be talking about the things that we don't know exactly what we're gonna be getting but our potential with this new update because they said multiple surprises are in store for us and this is just the knowledge that they have made public to us this is just the information they've given us and let us know that was going to be happening with this update 
but there's always things that they don't tell you. So, for example, with nerfs, patches, things like that, there's going to be weapons that have been too overpowered or maybe weapons that have been underpowered and no one's been using that they need to tune and buff out and make better in the game. So that's going to be one thing that we are expecting as well. There's also going to be some uh, stability fixes, things like that. There's been crashing. They've been already working on that, but hopefully with this bigger update, they're going to be able to add more into the game. There's also a mode that we are expecting to be added with this update, and that is called COD ball which is basically a rocket league version of call of duty so you have a, a atv that you're going to be driving and then there's a ball and then you're going to score on it originally we thought we were going to be getting it for this soccer cup event but uh, it hasn't been added into the game it seems like maybe it's unfinished but it is a mode that they're working on unfortunately i can't show you guys any video clips but there are clips if you do your research there are some clips that leakers have posted where uh it's just being in test it's not fully finished yet but it looks exactly like rocket league just imagine call of duty and rocket league if they were put together Together, and that's exactly what it is but we haven't had any information on when this update is going to be dropping we just saw that in the files so they never really officially said anything about it if it's officially going to be coming out or maybe it's going to be scrapped we have no idea but another thing is we're also waiting for warzone 2 updates as you guys know it's in a beta stage as well as dmz so they know there's a lot of fixes and things that they need to add and change and do because it is a beta after all and they need to do their fixes and things like that so that's another thing we're waiting on they never mentioned any warzone updates with the mid season update but that is expected to drop i mean obviously this is a really big update that we are going to be getting I don't have the exact file size for the update but what i can tell you guys it is going to be bigger than the season one update that we ended up receiving because they have to add enough content for the next month and i have the next season is set to start on february 1st which we're not we're not exactly at the mid-season point yet i mean when we got the original update in the first place update went live on november 16th this next update is going to be set to go on december 14th so we have half of the December and then all of January and then we get into February so that is over a month and a half of pretty much waiting that we'll need to do so hopefully this update is large enough to keep us going until then but as of right now there were rumors that maybe even after this update there might be another one coming in just to keep us going until then but I just hope this update is big enough to give us a lot of content I mean I know for a fact there's going to be a lot of free challenges blueprints events that are going to be coming up I mean we have Christmas we have the holidays and you know Call of Duty always does those holiday events so we're going to be hopefully seeing something fun like that being added into the game I will keep you guys updated on any news or any information that we get but as of right now this is everything that was made public to us uh, if there's any things that come up from like the files from leakers things like that i'll make a video separately and cover that for you guys as well but as of right now this is everything that you need to know about the next big call of duty update i definitely will be making a lot of videos covering everything if you guys made it to this point of the video i do appreciate it. thank you guys for tuning in and watching the entire thing also i have been uploading shorter form videos on tiktok facebook Instagram, uh, YouTube Shorts, whatever platform you prefer to use or watch your videos on, feel free to check it out. I have one for every single one of those down in the description. I feel like that will help you guys out a little bit more, especially with like the glitch videos. You guys might be able to find it easier if you just see it in a short form video, like on Shorts or TikTok, something like that. So anyways, thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys found this video informative. If you did, make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button. Let me know if there's anything else you guys want to see here on the channel. It's been your boy Trizzo. Hopefully I'll be seeing you guys here in the next one.